Hi, I'm Realtor Doug Yockum and welcome to How's the Market, our weekly recap of Grand Valley Real Estate with numbers pulled from Dijar, our very own uh, MLS right here in the Valley. All right, let's grab, get to the stats. Um, so our real estate update this week, our average home price is 447 um, 004. So that's down a little bit from a, a week ago, which was 447.750. So uh, pretty much holding steady there. Median home prices this week are 399,000, the same as last week. Um, number of homes active, actively for sale in the MLS right now is 553. That's up from 546 last week, slightly up. Um, number of homes currently pending sale here in the Valley, 364, same as last week, 364. Um, homes sold year to date, uh, 1,678 versus this time last year, which was 1,745. So, um, just a little bit, uh, a little bit less than last year. Our average days on the market, 78, same as, uh, last week. Median days on the market is 55, 56 last week. So about the same. Um, the percent of concession sellers are offering up is about 1.72% of the sales price. Um, the number of homes that have sold with concessions from the seller uh, was 101. Uh, percent of homes with concessions um, from the seller is 40.89%. So um, roughly we're getting close to half of the houses selling out there. Um, uh, the sellers are offering concessions to the buyers. Um, all right, we got some new listings to talk about here. So 824 24 Road in Grand Junction, listed by our very own Karen McLean Wilson. Um, if you're looking for an equestrian's dream, this is the this is the perfect home for you. This property is amazing. Um, you got a large, bright, open living space in the home, plus recent upgrades inside and out, and you're going to love all this home has to offer. The barn is amazing, super, super horse property. Um, go check that out if you're looking for it. It's listed for 825,000. It's on 1.59 acres. Um, the house is 2,282 square feet. Uh, it's four bedrooms with three baths. That also has two master or primary suites. So, um, and they're separated on both ends of the house. So it's a really great layout, a wonderful property. Go check it out. Um, 2028 West Liberty Court in Grand Junction up in the Redlands listed by Jen Taylor. Um, check out this showstopper and this place is m amazing. A meticulous home with a, floor, a flowing open floor plan, impeccable grounds. The landscaping is absolutely spectacular at this place. Um, the outdoor spaces, the outdoor kitchen is amazing. The, um, it's got a 20 foot by 60 foot saltwater pool. I think it's, I think somebody said that, um, it's the biggest residential pool in the Grand Valley. So, um, if you're looking for a pool and a wonderful, wonderful property, this place is just amazing. Green features throughout and a whole lot more. This is for 1.150, um, three beds, two baths, 2,237 square feet. And it's on a little over an acre at 1.13 acres. So, uh, absolutely spectacular home. Go check it out. Um, open house there this Sunday as well. So, uh, I encourage you to go check it out. It's a beautiful place. Um, we've got some uh, new prices to talk about here. So 2530 North 8th Street, number 205 in Grand Junction. It's a great commercial property listed by our very own Mike Park here at the Christie Reese Group. Um, it's now listed for 295000 um, It's a premier location near other medical facilities that make this a perfect option for those seeking medical, aesthetic, massage, therapy, um, or other similar office spaces. Yeah, it's really great, really great. A great price point too. Um, 1946 Rose Marie Court in Grand Junction is listed by Mabry uh, McClung. Is now 250,000. Uh, there are views galore from this large lot in the Soaring Eagle subdivision, and sellers are very motivated. Bring an offer today. Yeah, it's a nice, really nice lot up there in the Soaring Eagle subdivision. Um, finally, 403 East Third Street in Cortez, listed by Reese Stanley. Uh, is now two hundred thousand dollars. It's close to downtown. This home has um, vintage details and is ready for your update. So check that one out too if you're looking for something in Cortez. Um, yeah, thank you for joining us on How's the Market. Always be sure to tune in every Thursday at noon and don't forget to click the follow button uh, to know when we go live. Have a great day.